Hello everyone, let's solve the problem. Find the index of the first occurrence in a string. Given two strings, needle and haystack, return the index of the first occurrence of needle in haystack or minus one if needle is not part of your haystack. If we see the examples, sad but sad, needle is sad. Sad occurs for the first time at index zero, right? Okay. In this one, haystack is lead code, needle is leto. Leto doesn't exist in lead code right so in that case we return minus one now how are we going to find if this needle exists in our haystack or not we will take a window of this size that is three size and start from the very beginning of our haystack is this substring equal to our needle no move up is this substring equal to our needle no move up is this substring equal to our needle yes it's equal we will return this index okay if we see this example, our needle uh, needle is ODE, right? We start from here, three size, okay? Let's say our needle is of size four, okay? Then we will take a window of four size, okay? So in this case, it's three. It's the substring is not equal. We move up. It's not equal. Not equal. Then we come here, not equal, not equal, not equal, and finally equal. And in that case, we will return this index, okay? Let's say this is our example, okay? What we will do we will first check the first window okay not equal then the second not equal then third not equal not equal not equal not equal and finally we move out of bounds we haven't find found our needle so we return minus one now the thing is for each substring are we going to actually extract the substring no we are we are going to check the first letter okay if the first letters are equal then only we will try to extract the substring right otherwise there is no point in checking the whole substring is the if the first letter itself is not equal right so what now we are exactly going to do is check the first letter like let's see in this case is l equal to the l equal to uh, o no e equal to o no e equal to o no t not equals to o c not equals to o finally o is equals to o now we will try to check the substring of length uh, 3 from this character this index that is o if it's equal right because checking for these are not at all uh, useful right it's going to be a waste of time if the first letter itself is not equal right so in this case we will look for the substring okay if it's equal or not fine so what are we going to do we are going to put a pointer here at first we are going to start from here till which position this position right okay that is 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 fifth position okay now what is the length of this length of this is 8 and length of this is 3 right so 8 minus 3 is 5 okay we need to go till index 5 we will check till index 5 okay if our first characters are equal then only we will check if the substring is equal otherwise not if it's equal we return the index now let's write our solution let's take the length of our haystack haystack dot length also let's say k length of our needle okay now we start iterating on our haystack in i equals to zero i less than i less than what less than equals to size of the haystack minus size of the needle right that's what we saw right okay i plus plus if haystack dot caret i is equal to needle dot caret zero if the current character is equal to the first character of our needle then only we are going to check for the substring if it's equal or not let's say string sub str equals to haystack dot substring from where to where position i index i2 index i plus k that is length of needle right this is index i and index i plus k right k is not inclusive right if if we put k it will check till the position just before k right so i plus k if our sub str is equal to 
our needle okay then return i okay otherwise after traversing the whole string if we are not able to return a position that means we haven't found our uh, needle right in that case we return minus one okay let's try to run it let's submit cool now what is the time complexity the time complexity is we go of n minus k right we go of n minus k for this and occasionally we are extracting the substring right which is a big o of k operation that is big o of n minus k into k and ultimately it's nothing but big o of n into k okay and our space complexity is constant right because we haven't used any extra space okay what we just did is an implementation of string index of method in java right return a stack dot index of needle right it returns the first occurrence of this given passed in st string in our a stack right in case it's not present it will return minus one okay so that's all about this problem if you like this video do hit the like button share this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and i will see you in the next video bye, -bye.